that's a defense performance uh, we got to play with the rest of the series. Um, we play with, we didn't play with the first two games. And it was a big game for us. What did you see in the tape leading up to this game? Situations you could exploit to put everybody in love in situation. They're going to make the shots. They're not going to make them in some situations. But you guys were able to limit them and force the ball to get you. Uh, that was that was the whole goal. That was the plan. But um, you know, it kind of you know let LeBron beat it. And uh, you know, you have to take ownership on yourself because he was blowing past a lot of guys. He blowing past myself. So. Uh, you know, uh, we really had to lock in and be physical and be aggressive, and that's what we did tonight. There probably aren't too many players in the NBA that can make such a big impact on the game without even scoring a point until the end of the third quarter. What can you say about what Biz brought for you guys tonight? He knows his role. Uh, that's the NBA. You know, uh, you have all the guys. Everybody can't be the Kevin Durant, the LeBron James, Stephen Curry. So you got to understand your role, your niche, and he understands it to the T. And that's a prime example of a true professional. And I feel like that's what he did. He came in, he got every rebound. He didn't care about scoring a point. And uh, that's what we need for him to do for this team. You mentioned the free throw foul disparity quite a bit after game two, especially after what happened there. How important was it for you guys to remain composed, continue to play your game, regardless of what happened with the officials today? Yeah, we, gotta, we, gotta, we had to play aggressive. We had to keep doing what how we've been playing all year. Uh, we couldn't feed into, you know, the fouls, the difference in the fouls. And uh, so that's what we did tonight, man. We just came out, kept playing aggressive. If they was going to call fouls on them, they was going to call fouls on them. But we, we played our game, and that's what we got to do. We got to continue to play our game and not, you know, get into talking to the refs or complaining about fouls. You, you so obviously. That, uh, so many times guys get into foul trouble and then take them right out of the game. How tough is it to do what Kyle did to be very effective despite questionable calls and having to sit on the bench for a lot of the uh, first half? Um, Kyle, he's been doing all year for us, you know what I mean? He, uh, I think he really did on his defensive end. You know, he really got into Kyrie and he really did on the defensive end and that opened up his offense because we got out on the break, we were getting loose, loose balls, steals. And uh, he's been doing it all year, man. That's why he's an all-star. Uh, and we need for him to not only do it tonight, but do it game for us too. Core was great. Core was great, man. He came in and did what uh, he's supposed to do as a backup point guard. The starter went down, and he came in. We didn't miss a beat, and uh, that's the beauty of our team, man. You can't just key in on one or two guys. You got to key in on everybody. And I think everybody contributed tonight. You obviously had self belief as belief as a team going into this game, but what does this win do for you? It's a game, man. We won it on our home court. That's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to come in and win on our home court. That's what they did. So we're supposed to do the same thing, point blank. Mar, you had an elbow thing at the end of the game. Elbow. I, it's just it's messed up a little bit, but it, it'll be all right. It's just one of those things, man. Uh, I just got to keep playing through. Has it been bothering you before? Yeah. Yeah, it's been bothering me the whole series. So I can't look at it and, uh, you know, me, I'm going to play through anything. but. It's all right. I just got to keep stink, getting warmed up. And uh, when I get out there, halftime, coming in and sit down kind of bothers me. But I got to get out there and, and probably get more shots up on before third quarter. It seems like you guys didn't hesitate when the shots were available. It seems like you were a little bit less hesitant offensively, more aggressive uh, offensively as far as hunting shots. Um, yeah, I know me personally. I know a lot of the assistant coaches came to me and, and they wanted me to be more aggressive. Um, and they told me, they gave me the confidence. They told me to be more aggressive. Um, so that's what I did. Well, you guys had good offensive first quarters in, in, in Cleveland, first quarter. But then this, this time you were able to sustain that. We just stand aggressive, man. That's the biggest thing, man. We got to stay aggressive. We can't have two guys being aggressive, Kyle and DeMar, because they keying in on those guys. So we got to stay aggressive. Uh, you know, got role guys or guys, you know, who coming in the game. So that's what we did tonight, man. We came in, we was aggressive. Uh, Corey was aggressive, myself was aggressive, so we just got to keep playing aggressive basketball.